I'm gonna show you how to get free TV channels, HD TV as we cut the cord. I show you the best over the air antenna and we save money. Hi, I'm the YouTube deal guy, Matt Granite. I'm kind of holding this how I held my first board not too long ago. Great to be with you. I hunt down the biggest deals on the planet, but I also show you how to cut the cord and use free HD TV channels to your advantage. And there was a video I released not too long ago where a deal dropped on a flat panel smart pass HD TV antenna and you guys went crazy for it. The deal has returned. So I'm gonna do this up a little bit differently. I'm gonna actually give you the full unboxing because a lot of you wanted to see that. I didn't include that in the first video. And then you'll see clips if my shirt changes colors or my hair gets longer. Uh, these are the demonstrations and the product tests I've done over time. So I'm gonna have these edited into this video so you can actually see from start to finish. More importantly, if you wanna score the deal that I have found, which is a very limited time offering, expand that video description box right under me. There you will score the best price for what I consider to be the best HDTV antenna of 2018. Let's start with the the unboxing and then we'll get to the channels. All right, let's get this antenna out of the box. Now keep in mind, this is a larger antenna and I am gonna show you how I've hooked this up and then the channels that I can get. There are some of those flat panel, those ones that you can actually just hang up or mount. Some of them have adhesives on the back and those are good. The Mohu Leaf is actually a, a fantastic antenna which I've used, but this just gives you better range in my opinion. You get 60 to 70 miles plus you have a lot of accessories that allow you to set this up where you can at least diminish the interference with a really good filter. All right, this is the antenna itself. If you guys want a, an idea of how tall this is, I'm uh, just over 5'9", and this goes up to my knees. There we go, I don't know if that helps you. But it's not the most discreet thing, but the nice thing is you can use this indoor or out if you have a porch or something. It comes with the mounting bracket, which is great. Comes with a long range coax cable. Comes with a stand. Comes with the filter. This is the key. This filters out a lot of the interference and this will ensure you get that beautiful crisp HD reception over the air. So 4K, right? This is 4K capable, awesome. You have a TV that is so equipped. And then in here, because this is not a passive antenna, meaning that it is working with a power source, you have a little plug adapter right here. And the, the plug adapter is very, very, very small. Let me show you how we set this up and then more importantly, what types of channels I was able to receive. Just screw this right into the back of the cable in or where your antenna goes on the back of a television. Any television will have this port. The other end goes into the under part of the antenna. So one in there, one in here, you're good to go. There's nothing else you need to do. This again is an outdoor, indoor HD TV antenna. It's smart pass and amplified. It also has a 4G LTE filter, which means it cuts down on the distortion to give you that beautiful crystal clear picture, which I'm gonna show you in a moment. And while this antenna has a 60 to 70 mile range, if you do wanna use the included amplifier, this just gives you a little bit more of a boost. I don't need this even in a basement in Toronto right now. I'm really happy with the channels that I have access to. I'm gonna to show you now how to get the free channels added to your TV from the antenna. And we've already searched through the channels, but I wanna show you right now that on this smart TV, I already have Netflix, Amazon Prime, access to YouTube TV or Google, I should say. But if you aren't a Sling TV subscriber and you're not enjoying that live TV or direct TV now, you just really wanna see what an antenna can give you, this is what you need to do to set it up. On any regular television, you'll just go into your menu settings and do a search. You can auto-tune your channels or manual scan. Auto-tune is the easiest. The TV runs through all available channels and then programs them into your television guide. So all you have to do is change channels just as you would traditionally with satellite or cable and you'll know in a matter of seconds what you have access to. So this is a very powerful antenna. You can see that it's already starting to pick out channels. In most of our tests, we're able to get 12 to 15 channels. In some cases, you'll only get four channels. In some cases, you'll get 20 or 30. It depends on where you are and how far away you are from the broadcast source. Okay, it's moving faster than I thought. We're at nine channels and 100%. So nine channels from a basement. It's gonna scan through all of the other sources now. This is the part that I'm gonna skip because this will take a while. 
I should also mention that that I am using live television. Sometimes when people show you these antennas, they do all these fake roundabouts where the antenna is not actually the source. Just want to show you right now, this is live TV tied to the antenna. All right, so as you can see, I'm going to lower the smart menu right here for a second. This is absolutely beautiful, crystal clear, 4K on my television right now. This is high definition, so let's keep going here. Just Again, scrolling through the channels as you would traditionally watching cable, just using the remote. The TV is already familiar with what it's picked up. Beautiful. You just flick through channels as you would watching something else. And you can see the, the picture quality is tremendous. I am a huge fan of this antenna. And more importantly, the content that I'm now able to get for free. This is a great way to enjoy free television on a dime. And as we flick through, everything you need is there. The channels are all programmed into the television and maybe you'll be able to get many more, ch ooh, that does not look good. Maybe you'll be able to get more channels than I've had access to, I didn't mean to laugh. Okay, I just learned no one was injured in that truck incident, so there you are, everything's safe. Wonderful. Now the specific model of this Antop antenna is best used beside a window or outside as well. You can discreetly run the cable to your television source, no problems. But for me, one of the things that I've noticed is when I do these videos, I'll hear from a lot of people that say, oh, well, you know, you got 12 channels and I got four or I got two, it didn't work. And it's so dependent upon where you are geographically. So there is a resource located under this video screen where you can at least get a better idea of how many channels you are likely to receive. I should also mention that if this isn't right for you and you are not within range, there are some great cord cutting utilities out there, including a box, which I'll talk about in a moment. If you want to score this antenna, which is designed really well in the US and will also ensure that you don't have that interference with all of the other pieces of technology we have in our homes, this is a great grab that you can make right now. Keep in mind that as we lead into the holiday season, there'll be all sorts of other ways to cut the cord from the best Android TV boxes. By the way, I have a demonstration and deal on that. That's what I should mention, actually. Uh, for those of you that wanted to know a little bit more about a box that would unlock a lot of channels, there's another video that I want to show you. And if you click somewhere within the vicinity of where I am right now, you can actually score a deal on that. But for those of us that want to cut the cord with the antenna and you do happen to be within range of the source, this is a great grab that you can make right now. So let me know any other requests. The whole reason I knew to even do this video and to hunt this deal down again was based on your comments. So feel free to leave me a comment and a reminder. If you're not yet subscribed to this channel, I don't want you to miss anything from cutting the cord to smart tech to really unlocking more freebies that you can use to your advantage. This is what you need to do to subscribe. Click on my head right here. That'll subscribe you to this channel. If you need help turning on your notifications or leaving a comment, click here. And that last big roundup of deals I did, it's over here.